Hi everybody, this is Diane and I got a happy mail today from my friend Jill. I got the box, <coughs> the lid open, and now I'm ready to go in and see what's in here. She packed this box really full. Oh, look at this pretty border sticker. They're um, tabs and borders. Love those colors. They, these are definitely something I will use. They are so pretty. It's called Wild Asparagus is the company and the borders are called Girl. Girl borders from my mind's eye. Really nice. Thank you. get this out of here. Ooh, she sent me some of her homemade beads. She sent me some of those several years ago. Well, I don't, don't need to get it open now, I guess. You can see, but they're it's rolled paper. And they're shellacked or something. They're just beautiful. <clears throat> I'll have to make some dangles out of these. I've used a lot of them in the years since she gave me some. Thank you, Jill. They're extra special because I know you made them. Ooh, red cards and envelopes. Red for Christmas. Eight paper coasters. Well, these will make good tuck spots, won't they? Those are cherries and lemons. Those are nice. And these are 20 corrugated coasters. Different designs, nice bright colors. These are fun. They'll be good pockets and tuck spots too. I want to flip this over, but names and addresses are on that side, so I'm just going to put it out of the view of the camera. There we go. In fact, I'm just going to slide it down here. There. Now we have this beautiful little sheer drawstring bag. Oh my gosh. I've never seen rosettes like that. I love those colors. Oh. That's going to have to go on something special. I love them. And we've got a purple and blue and other color variegated yarn that I can use in tags. Nice tight little ball there, so there's probably a lot here. And red and pink. Oh, they're cute. Maybe for bookmarks, tag toppers. Think of something. Oh, she sent me some of these before. <laughs> I love them because they're such a different shape. They're playing cards. Oh, I'm going to have fun with these. Did they come in this? Hmm. Love those cards. Oops, it looks like we got more. 
whole pack of them. Yep, they came in this case because it says Umbra, and that's what the case says. Oh, thank you. Ooh, just in time. She, I'm making um, I'm going to make a, a Frosty the Snowman journal for Christmas. So I'll use some of those for that. They're little playing cards, too. I love the little shaped playing cards. And I believe she sent me at least some of these because I've had a few of these before. Aren't they pretty? Oh, look at the jokers. <coughs> They're cute. Old maid cards. I love the fancy shaped ones. It's like there's something else in there too. So these are the old maid. So cute. Oh, look at that. How pretty. Looks like from the from Roman days. I'm going to share some of these cards with Pirio. We're going to do a playing card swap pretty soon. Oh, and I've got more. Oh, look at the pretty pink shoe. It's an ornament. Got a little hangy thing. I'm gonna open one. She sent me two of them. Don't want to cut that ribbon. How pretty. I'm gonna hang this on my Christmas tree to remember Jill. So pretty. I love shoes. This is a gorgeous little um, card box on a keychain. I've never seen that. And these are teeny tiny little cards. And there's a hole. It's like a frame so you can use your finger to push the cards out. But it's just a little blue background. They are cute. I love those teeny tiny ones. It'll be fun. Here's some more teeny tiny ones. And these are more paper. Oh, they're fun. They'll be great to use in um, clusters and things. I like them. and mini playing cards, not to be confused with the teeny tiny ones. It's just fun using little things, isn't it? I think so. Crooked pack. Oh, that is cool. I love that. Something different. Oh, there's another shoe. Oh, she sent me some of these in a, we did a, what's it called, flowish journal swap a few years ago. And I got some of these round orange cards. Now I have a whole bunch of them. I love them. Like I said, I like the different shapes and different sizes. You have quite a collection here, Jill.
and she sent me this one too in the Flowish book. Opryland USA. Fun, fun, fun. Are they egrets? Oh, these are so pretty. I like them. Even the box is classy looking, isn't it? Congress. Got some dogs. They're really nice. Another shoe. I have shoes hanging all over my tree. I found a set of these at a flea market, but mine were in kind of not very good shape. These are nice. They're really pretty. I don't think I have any more of these left. And some floral arrangements. Very nice selection of cards. Thank you, Jill. I think that's all of them. And now I've got large things. It looks like paper packs with some stickers on top. So these things aren't in a package or anything. <clears throat> well, let's just pull out the stickers. It looks like there's paper down at the very bottom and stickers on top. Okay. So let's go through these. Oh, I like these. These are definitions. Very nice. I just have to remember to use them. There's a tag. It's got dimensional things on it. That's really pretty. Some more stickers with more definitions. I like these. And these are oh, uh, clear stickers, I believe. Oh, these are fun ones. Punctuation. This is called Bookworks Icons. Yeah, these are fun. And some more definitions. Very nice. I will definitely use these if I remember. Then we have purse and booklet die cuts. These are other ones you can buy. Well, I'll have to check that out and see what I can do with them. That's cool. So I guess it's a purse and booklet combined. This is what it looks like closed. This is what it looks like opened and you have a booklet in there. I don't know. I'll have to check it out. Looks interesting. This one has... Where does it say what it is? I guess it's, yeah, I guess it's a booklet. That's fun. It, had, it comes with all of this, and you make a book out of it. Well, isn't that just what we do? We make books. There's another one just like it. Ooh, pretty. These look like... Um, I forgot the name of the paper dolls. 
little paper called uh, Letty Lane or something like that, and she has an older sister and a mom. They, they, that's what these look like. <clears throat> but they're stickers. I love paper dolls. Some more definitions. Is that the same one? Nope. And more words. Tab stickers. They're cool. Yeah. Like them. Some more tabs with words on them. Ooh. Thanksgiving stickers, but they don't all have to be Thanksgiving. I like the vintage look of them. Oh, I like these. Oops, sorry, it's my phone. And it's nobody I want to talk to. These are travel stickers, the kind that you used to put on your luggage. They are cool. I like them. And this is Susan Branch border stickers with some other stickers too. How cute. I'm thinking of a traveler's notebook for these. I don't know why, it just came to my mind. And more Susan Branch. Aren't they pretty? My oh my. Oh, <laughs> zippity doo da, zippity a. My oh my, what a wonderful day. The earth laughs in flowers. Ralph Waldo Emerson. These are cute. And some more words from Cosmo Cricket. I like the old look to these. It's like uh, travel stickers. And these are punch outs. Fancy pants. Sweetie pie. That's what my husband used to call me. Somebody has to be the cutest. Well, I have four grandchildren and I'm not going to say which one is the cutest because they're all cute. I like these. So I've got this whole batch upside down. More fancy pants. I like the colors of these. Sometimes I get tired of doing vintage and I like to use colors. I love these colors. This is called Gypsy Harvest. The rich colors, how beautiful. Oh, they're Rolodex. You can see here, where they were punched out. How pretty are they? I love them. And they're double-sided. These are borders and some punch out tags and frames. These are fun. This is crate paper and it's cowgirl collection. <laughs> Maybe I'll save that for my Western journal. And this is cowboy collection. Yeah, I'll definitely save these for my cowboy journals. And this one is called Twirl. Love these pastel colors too. Those are great. I've never seen them. And this is the Hampton collection. Wow, I get lots of borders and tags and circles and frames. Oh, look how pretty these are. This is that Gypsy Harvest collection in there. Oh, pretty flowers and circles. They are gorgeous. Wow. Paisley and Petals. These are pretty. Pretty colors. Basic Gray. I know this one because um, I got the collection that goes with this at the flea market when I bought some um, bunches of scrapbook paper that somebody put in the flea market. And I have this collection, so I I don't know if I have these tags, but I recognize the patterns. So this will go right with that collection because I haven't used it yet. I don't think. I don't think I've used it yet. Cool. Um, tags and labels. This is acid washed. Look at those bright colors. Love it. I'm feeling inspired to, to do all kinds of things looking at these. This one is Sweet Pea Jack. 
that first one that I said I have is Sweet Pea Alyssa. Now, I know I don't have this, this one. Ooh. Oh, baby girl. Oh, these are adorable. And they're not babyish. They don't have to be used in baby journals. Even the elephants. And there's two of that one. This one is a Gypsy Match Book Kit. So this is the end product. That's fun. That'll make a nice um, insert inclusion. There's another one. And here's L Lily Kate Matchbook Kit. Oh goody, I'll get these all made up and then I'll have them ready to put into pockets and things. Really pretty colors. And this one is Urban Couture Matchbook Kit. Thank you. Some alphabet stickers. There's that color, yellow and blue and pink and very pale green. This is that Alyssa collection. And these are pretty stickers. Looks like the colors of the gypsy papers that I had. I think this is a different company but they do match pretty well. And there's some more corners. They're really fun. Different shaped tabs. I love these things. I wish I knew what these were called. And there's three of that. And then another one of these. Wow. You know, I've said before that I don't use a lot of stickers, but these are the kinds of stickers that I do like. The words and just everything in here, everything in here is things I would like. And the borders, I would use them. Now I think we're down to paper. How exciting. I love paper. I got this upside down. Just turn the whole pile. Fancy free collection from Fancy Pants make some room here. How pretty. And I love getting double-sided paper. Cowboy, oh great. Cosmo Cricket, Wanted, Buffalo Bill. I'm gonna have to get started on those cowboy journals before long, aren't I? Souvenir Journey. This one is also Cosmo Cricket. Really pretty and nice quality of paper. This is also from Souvenir called Memento. These are really lovely. Oh, that's the same. Memento. I got quite a few of those. I like them though. I like them. This one is Wanted, Slim Jim. So that could go in my cowboy journal too. Got several of those. Wanted, Kissin' Kate. I think there really was a Western woman called Kissin' Kate. Cotton Candy. This is We Are Memory Keepers. Juggler. Hoops. Hope you don't mind I'm going slow because I really want to see all this stuff. Scenic Root Paper Company. Kennedy, pink and orange. Ooh, I love that. This is Harvest, small Harlequin. I love that. I like the Harlequin pattern. <clears throat> I like that it's got the script on there. I have a stamp that 
has a big background stamp that looks like that. Doesn't stamp in those pretty colors though, unless I colored each individual diamond. Uh, B Buckley Stars Pink. Sugar Plum. This is Memory Box. Farmer's Market Collection. Ooh, Argyle. Pretty colors. It's got pink. Cherry Blossom. Ooh, I like the polka dots, too. This is Serendipity. Sassafras Lass. Serendipity, and this paper is Green Apple. This is so much fun. It's a good thing uh, I have an empty drawer in my 12 by 12 paper stack of drawers. This can all go right in there. This one's called Endive. There's a lot of them. It's this one that I showed. a nice um, subtle color though that'll go with a lot of things this one's called parsley these are the farmers market collection quite a few of this one too now I believe that Jill used to have a store so maybe these came from her store She's getting rid of stuff. This is called Chive. This is Vanilla Bean. Love that. That's a really pretty creamy background. <clears throat> this is really fun going through all these papers. I'm having fun. I hope you are. This is gorgeous. This is called Bohemia. And it's by MME. I don't know what company that. Oh, my mind's eye. Should have known that. This is also Bohemia. Wonderful colors. This one is Dream Street Papers, Letter from Julia, Love Notes. How pretty. It's got music and writing in the music and this um, Baroque type of swirly stuff. This is a little bit thinner. What's Cooking Collection? have to cover the back of that or use this for pockets or something. Woohoo! Here's the What's Cook It or What's Cooking collection. They're cool. They all have that on the back. I don't know why they would do that. Maybe because when you're putting them in a scrapbook you have them like this in the sleeve. So the back is covered. But I like them. I'll use them. Uh, seashore collection. This is called Sea Spray. Pretty, pretty color. And there's one with brown dots. This one is called Swim Dock. This one is Tangerine Splash. A lot of those. We're getting to the end. This one is Cafe Collection, Sidewalk Cafe Collection, Table for Two, Lasting Impressions for Paper Incorporated. This one is Merry Go Round, City Park Collection, Merry Go Round.
a lot of those. It doesn't bother me that there's a lot of some of these because I like every single paper. That's Tangerine Splash again. And Table for Two again. This one is Bohemia. Bluebird All Boy Dragonfly. Isn't that pretty? Kind of reminds me of Blue Fern Studio. So who is the company? Oh, this is my mind's eye also. Pretty. There's another dragonfly. I say Jill used to have a store. I don't mean an Etsy store. I mean a brick and mortar store. Paisley and Petals Cotton Blossoms. That's pretty. Look at the beautiful colors. Scallop and Stitch. This is Paper Salon. Bloom. Petite white floral, and look, they have a, a little color swatch there of colors that coordinate if you're trying to match things up to it. Devoted Dottie. This is one we've already seen. And this is Stained Stripes. Looks like wallpaper. So pretty character. Well, Jill, these are fabulous papers. Everything you sent me, the papers, the stickers, the playing cards, all the fun stuff is just wonderful. It's like you know me. <laughs> and you do. We've been friends for quite a few years now. We've never met, but we've been friends on social media. So thank you so much, Jill. I so appreciate it, and I will put these things to good use. And thank you all for watching, and you have a wonderful day, and I will see you again soon. Bye-bye.